Hello, everyone. Namaste and peace and blessings. Thank you so much for joining me in our online yoga school, Yoga Flow. I ask that we find our bodies in a comfortable seated pose. Any seat that feels good for you, may you find your position. As we are using our seat to help relax and ground our mind and our bodies here today. Ensuring that our spinal cords are nice and elongated, meaning we are not sunken. Having control of that body with the shoulders relaxed downward away from the ears. This allows us to ease any tension we may feel in our neck and our shoulders, just relaxing them down. Tummies are tucked in at our navel. As we breathe in deeply, exhale. Noticing how the breath feels within the body as we gaze our eyes downward or we'll close our eyes. Breathe in. Exhale. Breathing our palms at heart center, coming into a seated prayer. Maybe our thumbs are touching our sternum, the center of our chest, if that feels good for us. We're going to relax here in silent meditation for natural breaths. Two breaths. Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale through the mouth. Noticing what the breath does to the body. As we breathe our palms above our heads and our salute, fingertips flows up towards the heavens, filling that spinal cord, get nice and long. Interlacing our fingers with that pointer finger pointing up towards the heavens. Our shoulders flows up towards the ears. We are lengthening our spine. Tummies are tucked. Allowing the arms to slightly flow towards the back. Chin is up. Heart chakra is open. You'll feel a slight back bend here. Two breaths. Exhaling back to center. Separating those palms. Coming into that seated extended mountain. Twisting the body towards the right. Palms come downward towards the earth. Slightly gazing over our right shoulder. We can connect our left hand to our right knee if we choose to go deeper in that twist. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhale back to center, coming into a star. In a seated star, our palms are slightly out towards the side. Chin is up. Breathe in. Twist the body towards the left. Palms come downward towards the earth, gazing over that left shoulder. Spinal twist, opposite side. We can go deeper in that twist if we choose by connecting our right hand to our left knee. We're going to hold this three breaths. Two breaths. Exhaling back to center, coming into that star, flowing into our extended mountain. Exhaling to our salute, palms together, breathing down to prayer, relaxing those palms at heart center, allowing those shoulders to relax down, gazing the eyes down as we hang out here, silent meditation going inward. Four breaths. Breathe in through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. As we flow into a bound position, bringing our feet together, coming into a diamond or a butterfly. In our diamond, our feet are further away from our bodies. In our butterflies, our feet are closer. Both poses look very similar. They are both hip openers. Connecting our hands to our feet or our ankles. Heart chakras open, chin is up. Allowing the head to relax between the shoulder blades. We are in our seated cow. Two breaths. 
flow into our cat, chin comes to the clavicle, spinal cord flows to the back of the room, tucking that tummy in at our navel. Flowing back to cow. Exhale to cat. Coming back to neutral, we are either in that diamond or that butterfly. As we slightly hinge at the hips, tummies are tight. Noticing that when we hinge at the hips, you may feel it a little deeper in those hip flexors. So only going down as much as your body comfortably allows you to go down to. Listening to your body, my voice is just a guide. As our shoulders relax forward, our head relaxes downward towards our feet. We're gonna hang out here for breaths. Two breaths. Exhaling back up to center, using our hands to breathe our legs inward, straightening our legs, coming into a staff pose. Our legs are parallel side by side. Toes are pointing up towards the heavens. Back, spinal cords are nice and long. Shoulders relax down away from the ears as we are gaze forward here in our staff pose, taking a moment to check in with body. Three breaths. Two breaths. As we breathe our palms above our heads in that salute, feeling that stretch, interlacing the fingers, palms flow slightly towards the back, chin is up. Exhale back to center, separating those palms. Gaze forward, two breaths. Breathing those palms back together. Exhaling down to prayer hands. Palms at heart center, relaxing those shoulders down, away from the ears. Breathe in. Exhale, slightly hinging at the hips. We're going to point those toes downward towards the earth as we hinge, coming into that plantar flex, that ballerina's foot. Filling this stretch here within the lower parts of the body, behind the legs and our hamstrings. As our shoulders melt forward and our head melts down towards our knees, coming into a seated, complete forward fold if we're able, bringing our hands to our ankles or the bottoms of our feet. This here is a full body stretch. We're going to relax four breaths. Two breaths. And exhale back up to a half forward fold. Coming back up to that staff pose. Crossing our feet at our ankles. We're going to come onto our hands and our knees. Coming into a tabletop pose. Our knees are hip distance apart. Palms are flat on the earth. We're going to drop down to the cow. Our tummies come downward towards the earth. Chin is up. You'll feel a slight curvature in your lumbar spine. This Pose is great for lower back pain. We're going to hang out here. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhale into cat. Bringing that chin to the clavicle. Spinal cord flows up towards the heavens. Three breaths. Tummies are tucked at our navel. Two breaths. Flowing back to cow. Exhale to cat. Coming back to our table as we breathe our right leg towards the back, pointing those toes, feeling that stretch. As we pause that right leg up, we are working the gluteus maximus here. We are gazed forward, tummies are tucked. Two more breaths. We're gonna find that pause, extending that left arm forward, finding our bodies in our full sunbird. As we are gaze forward, we are balancing and strengthening here. Three breaths. Two breaths. Breathe in deeply. Exhale, bringing that knee to that elbow, feeling that crunch. Back to bird. Knee to elbow, 
Back to bird. Knee to elbow. Back to bird. Two breaths. Coming back to table as we drop down to cow. Flow into cat. Coming back to table, extending that left leg towards the back, feeling that stretch, pointing those toes if you choose. As we pause that left leg up, we are working at gluteus maximus, opposite side. Lifting and rounding that buttocks. Two more breaths. We're gonna find pause, extending that right arm forward as we are gaze forward, sunburn opposite side. Three breaths. Two breaths. Breathe in deeply. Exhale, knee to elbow, feeling that crunch. Back to bird. Knee to elbow. Back to bird. Knee to elbow. Flowing back to bird. Two breaths. Coming to table, dropping down to cow. Chin is up. Exhale, cat. Tucking that tummy at the navel. Flowing back to cow. Exhale, cat. Coming back to table, pushing the bodies up to down dog, gazing at the feet. Pressing our torso towards our thighs, feeling that nice deep stretch. As we walk our dog by pedaling our feet left and right. We're gonna find our pause, breathing that right leg up in the air, three-legged dog, gazing at the foot. Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale, knee to elbow. Back to three-legged. Knee to elbow. Back to three-legged. Knee to elbow. Working the arms. Back to three-legged. Exhale, down dog. Gazing at the feet. As we walk our dog, pedal on our feet left and right. We're gonna find our pause. We're gonna three-legged opposite side, left arm, left, left leg flows up in the air, gazing at their foot. Two more breaths. Breathe in deeply. Exhale, knee to elbow. Back to three-legged. Knee to elbow. Back to three-legged. Knee to elbow. We are working out upper parts of our bodies here. Back to three-legged. Exhale, down dog. Gazing at the feet. Dropping down to our dolphin, coming on to our forearms. Our buttocks is high in the air. We are gaze back at our feet. And maybe we can slightly walk our feet closer towards our bodies. You'll notice that your buttocks comes higher in the air. Pulsing up and down on your tippy toes if you're up to it. This is a headstand prep pose. We're gonna hang out here, pulsing up and down or staying still for four more breaths. Two breaths. Dropping down to our knees, we're gonna come into a wide-legged child's pose. Allowing the torso to relax between the thighs, our buttocks comes back towards our heels. 
Our arms are extended in front of us, making this an extended child's pose. Heart chakra comes downward towards the earth. Our forehead after that chakra connects to the earth, closing the eyes or gazing the eyes down. Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale. As we relax here in our child's pose, going inward, focusing on self. Five natural breaths. Breathing our palms together, flowing into a prayer hands, if that feels good for you. Three more breaths. Extending the arms back in front of us, palms are flat on the earth. As we spinal wave our bodies out of this pose, using our palms to push that body forward, using our palms to push our buttocks towards our heels, feeling that body wave, feeling that body move, feeling that body just flow like a wave, a spinal wave, four breaths. <sighs> Two breaths. <sighs> Finding our pause at center, coming back to our table. We're going to drop down to cow. Exhale into cat. Flowing back to table as we push the body up to down dog, gazing at the feet. Flowing into the three-legged dog, right side, lifting that right leg up in the air, gazing at the foot. As we bend that right foot towards that left buttocks, opening up that hip flexor here. And if we choose, we can flow over to a wild thing, feeling this nice deep back bend. Or we can come down to a down dog if we're unable to do this pose or don't feel like getting in this pose today. Three more breaths. Feeling that stretch. Exhaling out. Coming back to down dog. Walking our dog. As we flow to three-legged dog opposite side, that left leg flows nice and high. Gazing at the foot. Bringing that left foot towards that right buttocks, opening up that hip. As we flow into a wild thing, opposite side, feeling that back bend, feeling that stretch. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhaling out, coming back to down dog. Walking our feet to our hands, complete forward fold. Feeling this full body stretch as our head melts down towards our feet. <sighs> Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale. Feeling this stretch within the body. Maybe gazing the eyes down or closing the eyes. Feeling free to yogi walk your feet slightly apart to create stance, to create balance if need be. Four more breaths. Mm. Exhale, hands forward, fold, slightly gazing forward. Yogi walking those feet slightly apart, creating a nice stance. <sighs> Coming back down to a complete forward fold. Flowing into a rag doll, connecting the hands to the elbows, allowing the head to completely relax. 
You'll feel it stretch behind your legs and your hamstrings. Optioning to rock or sway side to side. If that feels good within your body. Noticing that when we rock and sway from side to side, we'll feel it a little more behind our legs here and our hamstrings. So we're simply just feeling a stretch here, relaxing and soothing, regulating our heartbeat. Five breaths. Finding pause at center, coming to a half forward fold. Come in nice and wide legged here in that half forward fold. Feeling that stretch. As Yogi walking those feet nice and wide. And we're going to keep on stretching and lengthening here. We're going to connect our left hand to our right ankle. Wrapping this right arm behind our backs like we're doing our thread the needle and slightly gazing over that right shoulder. Feeling this cross body stretch within the body. Four breaths. Two breaths. Exhale into center, coming to that half forward fold. Two breaths. <clears throat> Breathe in. Exhale, flowing that right hand to that left ankle, wrapping this left arm behind our back, slightly doing our thread and needle, gazing over that left shoulder, cross body stretch, opposite side. Four breaths. Two breaths. Exhaling back to center, half forward fold. Hanging out here in this wide leg, we're going to come up to a nice stance. Standing nice and tall. Pointing our feet to the outer parts of the yoga mat here. And we're going to bend our knees, coming into cactus hands. We are in that goddess stance. We are working the lower parts of our bodies here, building strength. Blowing our hands above our heads in that salute. Chin is up. Exhale the prayer, palms come to heart center. Two breaths. Coming back to cactus hands. Exhale, standing up to our standing star. Palms come out towards the side. Heart chakras open, chin is up. Gaze in the eyes downward or close in the eyes. Breathe in deeply. Exhale. Standing nice and tall. With our feet planted into the earth. Feeling grounded, feeling rooted. Eyes are closed as we are feeling like we are the star, visualizing the stars within us all. Those dark nights, those long days, whatever it may be, we can always shine brightly, right? So feeling nice and strong and tall here in our star pose. Shining bright, feeling bright, feeling powerful regardless. And at the same time, we are always going to be rooted and grounded, always staying humble. Keeping that chin up, keeping that heart chakra open, eyes are gazed down and closed. Three more breaths. Two breaths. Exhaling back down to that goddess, God stance, coming into cactus hands. Pulsing the body up and down. We are working different muscles in our legs here. Tummies are tight. Finding pause at center. We're going to rock our body side to side. Noticing the muscles that we are working here. Yes, we are toning and firming the lower parts of our bodies here. 
At the same time, we are working our arms. Four more breaths. Two breaths. Finding pause at center. Flowing our palms above our heads and next root. Chin is up. Exhale the prayer, palms at heart center. Two breaths. Exhale, complete forward fold. Connecting the hands to the ankles, head melts down. Four breaths. Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale through the mouth. Three more breaths. Walking the hands forward, bringing the legs together, down dog. Breathing our left, I'm sorry. Breathing our right foot to our right hand, runner's lunge. Dropping that left knee down, low lunge. Lifting our torso away from our thigh. Breathing our arms above our head, crescent lunge. Chin is up. This here prepares our body for split. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhale, framing that front foot. Taking that left knee off the earth, back in that runner's lunge. Straightening that front leg, coming into that pyramid. Torso relaxes over that thigh, head melts down towards the knee. Feeling this stretch. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhale back to runner's lunge. Breathe down dog, gazing at the feet. Walking our dog, pedal on our feet, left and right. Finding that pause, we're gonna breathe our left foot to our left hand. Runner's lunge, opposite side. Lowering that right knee down towards the earth, no lunge. Pushing our torso away from our thigh. Breathing our arms up in the air, heart chakras open, chin is up. Crescent lunge. I'm gonna hang out here, three breaths. Two breaths. Exhale forward, framing that front foot. Taking that right knee off the earth, back in that runner's lunge. Exhale the pyramid, straightening that front leg. Torso relaxes over that body, head melts down towards that knee. Still in that stretch. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhale back to run his lunge, bending that front knee. Breathe down, dog. Gazing at the feet. Walking our feet towards our hands, complete forward fold. Exhale, half forward fold. Breathing to our tadasana, palms are at our side. Breathing our palms above our heads and our salute. Chin is up. Breathe in. And exhale. Separating our palms coming into that extended mountain. Palms are separated. When our palms are together, we are in that standing salute. Separating the palms brings us into that standing extended mountain. As we lean our bodies towards the right, feeling this side bend. Slightly gazing up at the heavens if you choose. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhaling back to center. Leaning the body towards the left. Slightly gazing up at the heavens if you choose. Feeling this here in your side body. Three breaths. 
two breaths. Exhale and back to center, extended mountain. Bring in the palms to salute, palms together above the head. Exhale down the prayer, bring in those palms at heart center, relaxing those shoulders down with away from the ears. Gaze in the eyes downward or closing the eyes. As we are using this time to take a moment to go inward, checking in with self, noticing how we feel right here, right now, in our present moment, simply being aware, being mindful, without judgment, just taking notice. Always being kind and loving to oneself no matter what's going on. As we stand here in our standing prayer, may we take the time to focus on self. May we take the time to see how we are with self. And may we just take a moment to remember to always love self and be kind to self. We're going to hang out here five breaths, silent meditation. Two more breaths. Slightly hanging at the hips. Coming into that half forward fold, we're going to keep our prayer hands. Gaze in the eyes down. Taking a nice smile, smiling, feeling a smile on a face. Two more breaths. As we bend our knees, coming into a chair pose, extending our arms in front of us, if that feels good. Four breaths. Two breaths. Bringing the palms back in the prayer hands, twisting the body towards the left or right, prayer hand twist. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhale back to center. Prayer hands twist opposite side. Three breaths. Two breaths. Exhale back to center. Two more breaths. Exhale, complete forward fold. This is a counter stretch. Allowing us to relax and soothe our muscles. Head melts down, breathe in. Exhale. Four breaths. Walking the hands forward, coming back to down dog, gazing at the feet. Dropping down to the knees, we're gonna come into a puppy pose. Buttock stays high in the air, torso comes downward towards the earth. Arms are extended in front of us, we are in that extended puppy pose. Forehead, third eye chakras connected to the earth. Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale. Still in those shoulder blades melt forward as we relax here. Five breaths. Breathing our palms together, flowing them into a prayer hands above our head if that feels good for you. Three more breaths.
extending our arms back in front of us, palms are flat on the earth. We're gonna spinal wave our bodies out of our puppy pose. We're gonna do four spinal waves. Two more. As we find our pose at center, coming back to table, palms are on the earth, dropping down the cow, chin up. Exhale to cat. Coming back to our table, we're gonna cross our feet at our ankles, coming onto our buttocks. Just for a second, we're gonna flow onto our backs, coming into a reclined position, breathing our knees into our chest, hugging our knees into our chest. Allowing those shoulder blades to melt back into the yoga mat. Gazing the eyes down or closing the eyes. Breathe in deeply. Exhale. Extending the legs up in the air, legs on the wall poles, pointing those toes up towards the ceiling, up towards the heavens. Feeling that stretch, reaching our hands down to the backs of our legs as we breathe our legs towards our torso, legs to torso stretch, our buttocks might come slightly off the earth. Exhale back up to legs on the wall or invisible wall as we breathe our knees in. Allowing our knees to flow towards the left. Recline spinal twist. Feel the net spinal cord decompress. Relax and soothe here. Shoulders melt back into the earth. Right arm comes out to the side like a lowercase t. As we are gazed up at the heavens or gaze over that right shoulder. Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale. Feeling the body relax and soothe. Four breaths of silence. Exhale back to center, hugging those knees into the chest. Allowing the knees to fall towards the right. Recline, spinal twist, opposite side. Feeling that spine decompress here. Soothing. You may even feel it cracking. Left arm goes out to the side like a lowercase t. Gazing up at the heavens or gazing over that left shoulder. As our shoulder blades melts back into the yoga mat, we're going to soothe and relax, silence. Meditation, four breaths. Exhale back to center, hugging the knees into the chest. Allowing the feet to go flat on the earth, knees are still in the air. Shoulder blades melts back into the yoga mat. Feeling the arms relax and soothe, gaze in the eyes down. Three breaths. Two breaths. <sighs> Using our palms and our feet to lift our pelvic tilt, to lift our hip bone up in the air. We are in that pelvic tilt. We're going to work on a bridge pose. Bringing our hands together underneath our buttocks. Walking our shoulder blades towards our spinal cord. Our chest comes higher in the air. Our hip flexors come higher in the air. We are nailing that bridge. We're going to pulse 
that gluteus maximus up and down. We are working on lifting and rounding our gluteus maximus. This is also a pelvic tilt. It's great for people who sit in office chairs all day. It counter reacts to sitting in a chair all day. So tilting that pelvic forward, rounding and lifting at gluteus maximus, eight breaths. Still in that squeeze. Coming down slightly and lifting the gluteus, the gluteus maximus up nice and high. Feeling that burn, feeling that squeeze. Squeeze, squeeze, nice and tight. Three more breaths. Two breaths. We're going to do a bonus crossing that gluteus maximus down a little. And we're going to cross it back up and we're going to squeeze it nice and tight. As tight as you can, feeling that burn, rounding and lifting. Two more breaths. Uninsulating those fingers. We're going to untuck those shoulders, breathing the knees into the chest. This is a counter pose to what we just did, relaxing and soothing the gluteus maximus muscle here. Lifting the legs up in the air, legs on the wall. Pointing those toes towards the heavens. Breathing our hands down to the lower parts of our legs and breathing our legs towards our torso. Buttocks come slightly off the earth. Feeling that stretch, three breaths. Exhaling back up to legs on the wall. Breathing our knees into our chest. Extending our legs parallel side by side, coming into our Shavasana, our rest pose. The sides of our feet are connecting. The sides of our feet are connecting or touching as we allow our feet to fall to the side like a V. Completely relaxing our legs here. Feeling those shoulders and those arms relax back into the earth. Placing our palms at any body part that feels best for us. Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale. Gaze in the eyes downward or closing the eyes. Feel in the body. Note. Relax. We're on a cloud. We're soothing, we're gliding, we're guiding. We are blissfully into ourselves, happy, content with who we are and where we are, loving and understanding the process of life, knowing that every day we are working to live, we are working to be who we are. Just living and doing and being free and happy with every part of our lives. Maybe take note of that. And any other thoughts or feelings or emotions that you may have, may we realize them, may we recognize them. May we be mindful of them as we go in relaxing here in our silent meditation, eight natural breaths. As we slightly roll onto our side, coming into a fetal pose, keeping our eyes gazed down and closed, if that feels good for you, four breaths.
two breaths. Slowly wiggling our toes at our, slowly wiggling our toes and rotating our ankles. Moving our hips here, feeling our rotations here as we are awakening our body. We can keep our eyes closed if we choose as we use our top hand to push our bodies up into a fetal pose. I'm sorry, push our bodies up into a seated pose. However, we can stay in our rest pose or our fetal pose if we choose. I'm gonna come into a cow face lace. May you find any seat that feels good for you or any position that you would like to close out your session here today. If we are seated, if we are seated, ensuring that our tummies are tucked at our navel, spinal cords are elongated, meaning we are not sunken, control of that body, shoulders relaxed down away from the ears, Taking a nice deep breath in. Exhale. Chin is slightly up, eyes are gazed down. Breathing our arms above our heads and our salutes, feeling that stretch. Palms together. Exhale down to prayer, relaxing those palms at heart center. Keeping those shoulders relaxed down. Our chin is relaxed. Our facial muscles are relaxed. Our forehead is relaxed. Palms at heart center if that feels good. Palms on your lap. As we use this time to go inwards, thanking ourselves for allowing ourselves to practice self-care here today. For in a busy, busy world, it is a beautiful thing when we find time for self. And I would like to thank you for allowing me to practice self-care with you here today, for it truly, truly is a blessing. The light in me sees, appreciates, and respects the light in you. Namaste. Namaste and peace and blessings. I just would like to thank you one more time for joining me here today. I hope all is well. Take care of oneself. Love oneself. Be kind to oneself. Love and light. Until next time. Thank you.